In other news, 51 pupils and students with disability in the Bon Katamansu municipality of the Greater Accra region had their fees paid in full through the 3% District Assembly Common Fund for Persons with Disability, Chairman of the Ghana Society of the Physically Challenged in the Bon Katamansu municipality, George Na, wants more persons with disability to benefit from the fund. Twelve-year-old Florence Kumsen is having a seizure. She has epilepsy and has to endure seizures on a daily basis. Epilepsy is a central nervous system disorder in which the brain activity becomes abnormal, causing seizures or periods of unusual behavior, sensations and sometimes loss of awareness. The situation, she tells me, is becoming embarrassing for her as she's become a laughing stock in her community at Dechile in the Tungkatamansu municipality in the Greater Accra region. The fact that I was a small child, then it, I don't know that it came. Then some fake to come and enter inside. Like if I did not eat early, mm. then it had become, then I'd be falling down. Unfortunately, Florence has to drop out of school due to her condition. First, they have been calling me for name. Like? And I'm crutch. What name do they call And I'm crutch. Mm -hmm. And what again? French. And how do you feel? I feel bad. Uh, she stopped school because of her falling down um, and not intentionally, unexpectedly. Anytime they bring her home, you can't go back anymore. We keep her in the house, sometimes two days, three days before we take her back to the school. Her family cannot support her livelihood, and they told me, though they are aware of the 3% District Assembly Common Fund for Persons with Disability, they are yet to access it. Florence did not have to drop out of school, as there is support for persons with special needs. Through the 3% District Assembly Common Fund for Persons with Disability, 42 persons with disability in the Tmunkatamansu municipality have had their fees paid in full in the last quarter of 2018, amounting to 19,669 CDs. Veronica Teria is one of the beneficiaries, a pupil of the Mount Sinai Methodist School, a private school in the Tmunkatamansu municipality. Veronica is physically challenged and has to navigate her way through the stairways of the one-story classroom block, which is not disability friendly. <laughs> But that doesn't stop her from getting an education. They've been laughing at me that I was holding crutches in there. I can't do what a, a, a person who has leg can do. But me, I don't concern about anything. Her peers are supportive of her and determined to help her excel. I like how she behaves. She likes learning. And she like reading. Oh, disability does not end one's life. So I've been encouraging her always. At first, she's supposed to join a class. I made her to join a class at down because of her disability. As she said, no, I still want to come to this place. So I said, OK, then if you still want to be at this place, then I will encourage you to be at this place. So she's doing well. Veronica is not the only beneficiary. Theophilena Atreo Wilson is in school thanks to the 3% District Assembly Common Fund for persons with disability. Theophilia is a very nice girl. She likes playing, she speaks English, she speaks the Gatu. But a problem is for a sight. Because of the formica board, when you write, you find it difficult to pick the letters on the board to write. They see her as a white person. Some of them call her brofonio. Some of them call her natre. They play with her. The school we decided to open children with disability because we want them to know that they are part of the society. 
they too, they can do something. The president of the Ghana Society of the Physically Disabled in Etbon Katamasu Municipality, Eric Na, explains why education is prioritized in the 3% district assembly common fund for persons with disability. Once you are a person with disability, you qualify for a, a district assembly common fund. I have the parents so that they will pay the, 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 the fees and be the bill so that the assembly pay. The money allocated for a school fees. So, as for school, we don't have program. Once we gain it, we will pay for you. He's hopeful more persons with disability will be roped in to benefit from the fund. And that's it for Mission. Mission is brought to you by Star Ghana with funding from Danida, UK Aid, and the EU. Thanks so much for watching.